everybody happy halloween crafty friends so we have a fun quick little make for you this is one of the display domes and you know candy and so i had to do a couple of things with candy so i did this display dome i used one of my christmas woodland trees and i sprayed it with the new mica spray stain in jack-o-lantern and that's the only thing that i colored the tree with was the mica stain I, let's see, I, I actually glued that on so I can't take it off. So I hope that the glare isn't too bad. But I used one of the urns, I painted it black, and then I put the midnight, I think it's midnight glitter on there. And then for the tree, I had to put some tiny lights in. And I colored the tiny light, lights with ember alcohol ink, and then I stuck them in, and then took my finger and I put uh, glossy accents all along the edge, the, the little tips of the tree, and then rolled it in the midnight glitter so that it would have bits of sparkle. Don't know if you can see that. I don't know why I'm clear over on the side. All right, so I'll move more to the center because that's annoying. All right, so anyway, you can see it lights up just a little bit. And then I used the alcohol ink to color some of the distress glitter so that it was orange and then I put glossy accents on a few of the little pumpkins and sugared those so they look like sugared pumpkins. I used alcohol inks to color the candy from the confections and then I took my to some toothpicks and I did this last year in my candy store and I just put some glossy accents on the end of a toothpick and I rolled it in the new mica flakes. The, let's see. Oh, these are midnight mica flakes. And so it must be nightfall glitter, right? Yes, the nightfall glitter and the midnight mica flakes to make rock candy, black rock candy that I put in. The new jack-o'-lanterns, they are so cute, aren't they? And that little handle, oh my goodness. So I had to make two makes with the jack-o'-lanterns and the candy because I just loved it so much. So this is the color, this is what the candy looks like when you color it with alcohol inks. And I finished it off with a little bit of the new velvet trim that was part of the January release uh, in orange. This is from the warm set. And I used the, I am pretty sure I used campfire distress crayon on this. And this is one of the, give me a second. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, quote seals. I think it's a quote seal. Uh, anyway, and it says, In the secret of the shadow lies magic to behold. Because candy? Yeah. That's like Disneyland magic right there. And sparkly with all the glitter. And I, I put a little bit of glitter on the bottom inside of the dome also. And then on the bottom, I carved it out so that I could stick that light in. I've seen several of the makers do that, and so I thought I'd give it a try myself. And there you go. Super quick little make with the display dome, the jack-o'-lantern, the candies, and things like that. I hope this inspires you to get started and to play with the new confections and the jack-o'-lanterns and things like that and make your own little bit of candy magic.